This museum belongs to the people of Northeast Ohio, and that is our great opportunity. The community comes to the museum, the museum can reach out into the community. The collection, the building, the staff, the programs of the museum all position this institution to provide an extraordinary service to Cleveland and the rest of Northeast Ohio. Community engagement is absolutely essential, especially for a great civic institution like the Cleveland Museum of Art. Today we're doing the Cool Nights program. We had people come in and show us some art to go, and the children were able to see some of the helmets and some of the armor that the knights used. So today they were going to be making some of the things that they saw. This is really important that we bring the artwork to the community and it gives kids the idea that, that, that the museum is not a sterile, iconic fortress. It's open to the community and it's like a hub. A lot of them didn't know about the Cleveland Museum of Art. Maybe they've heard of it, but now they know right up the street is an art museum. They can look at the different genres of art. They can learn about it. So it's basically opening up their world. It's widening their horizons and I think that that's what the partnership is doing. It is extremely important to engaging today's audiences, to engaging new audiences, to engaging younger and non-traditional museum audiences. We need, to, we need to be creative, we need to be imaginative. Many of our children have uh, special artistic gifts, and so I'm looking forward to the young people being more formally integrated into the museum as well as into the community, and so this is a good way for them to explore, experience, and demonstrate their creative side. This one's gonna be a volcano, but I'm not, I'm not quite finished with this one. I'm amazed at some of the things they've come up with. You always kind of come in with a sample project and kind of where you want the kids to go, but some of them just take it above and beyond and have really impressed me. The experience of the artists, their uh, willingness to work with the children, their passion and their uh, enthusiasm, and it's just been a wonderful experience for all of us. I love the parade. I think it's the greatest celebration of the arts and community and diversity. <laughs> I love the energy here because we have so many creative people and there's so many people who are just like excited to be making art and doing really cool things that you don't get to do normally as an artist or as a community member. I think I like um, making art with people who aren't necessarily used to making art. and. Um, like seeing people experience it for the first time, you know, it's a challenge, but I think people surprise themselves, and that's nice to see. One, two, three. And every year we develop choreography, songs, uh, dances, whatever have you, games, and we make the headpieces that you see with the kids making. For a lot of them, probably it's the first time they do something out of their community. And for us, what is important is the relationship and how art is part of that community celebration. And you can see them light up. It's definitely making change. And the pride really, of course, like the show day is when it really shines, because you just kind of let them go, and they, they, they come through in a way that you, you never expect, and they always, they always surprise you. Innovation in our programs, innovation in our methods of community outreach, all are vital to, uh, to achieving our mission. The Cleveland Museum of Art has always served as one of the finest resources in the city for us. The kids coming in and learning the behavior and the atmosphere of the museum has really come a long way and they're really starting to engage at a higher level. The Art Lens app has been absolutely incredible. We ended up staying in Gallery One, uh, just exploring the collection with Art Lens. Now that these kids really enjoyed, I think, maybe the best visit thus far, you know, we can now uh, move forward and start to use it in other areas of the museum. <laughs> Innovation 
extends to communication. Social media, for example, is incredibly important now to, uh, to reaching audiences that might otherwise be difficult for us to reach. Our family programs are really about everybody doing something together. And they're not children's programs, in fact, our space here is really about intergenerational groups and families playing together. And for many of our families, they've never had the experience of the museum before. So it's a good way to introduce our residents to the institution and a good way for the institution to understand what our values are and what we hold dear and to have an authentic partnership. Community engagement is, is the future. We have the space now to do wonderful programs, educational programs, public programs, outreach programs. The community is focused as never before on its museum. The opportunity is fantastic. And so this chance that you could come here, you know, do all these free activities, participate in our community, just be here. It's a really wonderful thing to be part of. So blessed. And I was looking for something that, you know, would engage the children. I wanted something that was good, something hands-on. We couldn't ask for a better partner in the museum. We know the sky's the limit. The museum has really taken on a opportunity to grow and nurture future artists. And they're gonna be found right here in this community. I'm so sure of that. <laughs>